On today's episode of Who Did I Marry? Part 52, I'm just kidding. <laughs> did you watch the whole thing? I sure did. I was invested, girl, I was invested. We're gonna be doing a green look today. I feel a little green, a little springy vibe coming on, so that's what I wanna do. So the first thing I'm gonna do is do my cleanup under my brows and apply my base, both on my upper and lower lash line and spread and even all of that out. First, I'm going to go into some of my bronzing powder and with that, I'm actually gonna place this all over the lid. Next, I'm gonna go in with my green eyeshadow. I'm gonna take the deeper green and I'm gonna to start to buff this into my lower lash line and I'm also gonna be creating like a winged effect. Next, I am gonna take the shade called Mary Jane and with that, I am going to just sprinkle it on the center of my lid. I don't want it to be super opaque. I just want a little wash of color. So I'm gonna take my first brush with the brown color. I'm just gonna really buff that green out because I don't want it to be so opaque. I want it to be a little bit more sheer. Throw on your lashes and you're good to go. So now it's time to move on to the face. Let's moisturize and hydrate so our makeup can look good. Next, I'm gonna go in with a mattifying primer and I'm just gonna place this mostly in my T-zone area. Next, I'm gonna go in with my MAC Paint Pot and this is going to defeat creasing and it's going to color correct at the same time. For my second primer, I'm gonna go in with a loose powder and just set that MAC Paint Pot around my mouth as well as just press this into the center of my face. For my all over color, I'm gonna be using concealer and we're gonna apply this everywhere and avoid under the eye. Now it's time for our concealer. We're gonna apply this in the center of the face mainly and we're gonna let it sit for a minute. Now we're gonna go in with our liquid blush and blend that out before we blend out our concealer. And because we're gonna be overlapping, I like to really lay it on. Using our fiber puff, I feel like this is literally the best thing since sliced bread to blend out your concealer. The way it blends, and still leaves all that coverage, like it's just amazing. Now this is where your damp sponge comes in. It's the set the face with powder. I promise you a damp sponge for setting the face is where you're gonna be winning. Now we're gonna warm up the face a little bit with our bronzer. Now we're gonna sculpt our nose, give it a cute little shape. Now it's time for our blush. I'm gonna be using a bright pink blush. For my tear duct color, I'm gonna go with this like army greenish. It's a real shimmer type of shade and I'm just gonna pop that in there. That's pretty. Now it's time for the lips. The first thing I am going to do is line them with a reddish brown color. In the center of this, I am going to be using a matte liquid lipstick that is nude. And on top of this, we definitely need to add a gloss. And there you have it, a little spring beat that is definitely a treat. <laughs> 